Hey there, Jonathan here, Magic Peace Love. This one's for the magicians. In fact, I'm going to talk about the fifth edition Orbit deck, which just came out. My pal Chris Orbit Brown, talented guy. I knew him since he was a kid before he became a magician and he's become a great card magician and uh, entrepreneur, and he's put out these wonderful decks of cards. This is the fifth edition, which has a really cool new back design, which I dig. But I actually want to tell you about a couple of the cards on the face that you might not know, some trivia about the fifth edition Orbit deck and a built-in magic trick that you can do based on the ink. So uh, the first thing is that the Jack of Diamonds is Chris. So that is Chris Brown right on there. So whenever you look at these cards and you come across the Jack of Diamonds, you say, oh, that's cool, that's Chris. And then if you want to get romantic, the Queen of Diamonds is his wife, Holly. So that's kind of a nice thing as well. You have Chris on the front and you have uh, Chris on the, uh, on the Jack of Diamonds and Holly on the Queen of Diamonds. And then you have the King of Hearts, which is Chris's dad. Another nice little thing on this card. Now, there is a weird thing with this card. I don't know if you notice up here that it's missing the heart. So it has a heart right under the king there, or over the king, depending on what your perspective is. But on this one, it's actually missing the heart, which is kind of a bizarre, a bizarre phenomenon. It was not deliberate. It was actually an accident that he discovered after the fact. We thought that was kind of a happy accident, so it's all good that that happened. Now, there is a cool thing you can do with this, which is that if you pass your hand over it, you can rub just like so, you get a little bit of the ink, kind of comes off of the surface on these things. You can cluster it down here, and then you just give it a little push, and you end up with that heart on there. So now, unfortunately, as you can probably tell, the king is a little faded compared to these other ones here. It's a, a much more faded ink, but it's worth it because at least, even though it is faded once you're done, at least you end up with a king that has all the hearts on it, which is what you want when you have a king. You want a king that has hearts all over on both sides.